Hi, I'm Ed Escudero, representing the local section of the American Chemical Society for National Chemistry Week. We hope you're going to be able to experiment with a chemist. Welcome back. In this demo, we're going to talk about a super saturated solution. In the flask, I have a solution of sodium acetate. It is a white crystalline material that looks like table salt. I dissolved it at a very high temperature and then I let it cool to room temperature. The demo indicates that most solutions, there's only a certain amount of solid that can dissolve. Now, I have tricked this one into dissolving more than should dissolve at now room temperature. To test it out, I have a few crystals of sodium acetate. I'm gonna put just one little crystal on the plate and we're going to pour the sodium acetate onto the crystal and usually this will bring out the material and since so much of it was dissolved it's now coming out of solution and we have a pillar of salt. I was going to pour a second solution, but as you can see, something stirred it and it crystallized in the flask itself. So I was not able to actually pour the solution. If I bring my hand next to this, it actually appears to be warm. Well, a number of years ago, Somebody decided if we took the solution, as I showed you first, if we sealed it in a rubber, rubberized bag, and there's a little tiny popper that's on the inside, and usually to get the reaction started, as we see here or here, the little popping solution will actually do it and I'm not sure how visible it is to you, but the solution that is inside is crystallizing. And I can feel from my hand, it is really warm. So the enterprising person had seen the demo and has turned it into a hand warmer but so much heat is given off that if you don't use a towel or a piece of cloth between your skin and the heater, you, you can actually burn yourself from the amount of heat that comes off. A different one uses a different popper and you can see again, just that little tiny bit of kinetic energy is enough to get the reaction started. And again, this is extremely warm to the touch. The nice thing about them is these are reusable. All you have to do is put them back in boiling water and when they completely dissolve, pull them out, let them come to room temperature and you can reuse them. So again, a super saturated solution is one that we've tricked into holding more solid in solution than it normally would at that temperature.